Do you still remember Loris Karius? Looks like the infamous ex-Liverpool goalkeeper, whose mistakes caused the Reds to champions like victory, has found one elsewhere. The German started an affair with hot Italian TV presenter Dilla Taliata, drawing attention to his persona once again. In today's video, we are to talk about the new celebrity football couple, so give us a like and let's get started. Eccentric and egotistical Loris Karius could mentally recover from defeat in the 2018 Champions League final, when he conceded two nightmare goals from Real Madrid. After the fateful clash, he had no future in Liverpool and has literally disappeared from the radar. Those mistakes and the arrival of Alisson resulted in Liverpool loaning Karius to Besiktas for two years. There he was the number one choice, who helped win bronze medals of the Turkish Super League. Though, even back then, it seemed the guy was losing interest in the number one game. While playing for Besiktas, his goalkeeping mistakes did not vanish. But on the contrary, their number has just increased. Ultimately, the Turkish side refused to buy out Loris's contract and the Let's spend the next season on loan at Union Berlin. While in Germany, he lost the competition for starting 11 and made only five appearances throughout the whole season. The further he kept going, the worse it got. Liverpool were unable to find a club for Karius in the final year of his contract, so he spent all of last season without football, training at the red space. Finally, the lad left the club after his contract came to an end. In September of this year, the goalie penned a short-term deal with Newcastle until the end of this year. The Magpies lost Martin Dubrovka to Manchester United and his backup option Carl Darlow picked up an injury so the team acquired Nick Pope as an emergency measure instead. At the time of these videos' release, Karius had not spent a single minute on the pitch for the tune. Unfortunately, this is what we end up with for the football adventures of Loris after the crushing Champions League final. But, as we already mentioned, after the moral trauma of 2018, Karius found salvation in other matters. He used to be a great fashionista who was taking good care of his body. He especially got into bodybuilding. Here's how he looked when he played for Liverpool and after he began his loan journey. It's unlikely that by increasing his size, Loris had a positive effect on his speed and agility, so one can't say that he was thinking about football while hitting the gym. Such an increase in size has given rise to many rumors regarding Loris's future and whether he plans to pursue his sporting career at all. On social media platforms, fans noted that Karius is training to join the WWE, also comparing him to the Terminator. As for other hobbies, Karius is an ardent fan of Formula One. For example, he shared a photo from the recent Monaco Grand Prix. Besides, like many other football celebrities, Loris is not indifferent to the NBA. That he takes care of himself, likes to dress with a style, and Internet users label his appearance as Hollywood and compare him with Chris Hemsworth. Alright, we have already found the perfect candidate for the Thor remake. Looking at Karius, it's easy to guess that he has never had a lack of female attention. Before Miss Liotta, he had several relationships with other girls, which we will dwell upon in a second. When the German moved to Liverpool back in 2016, his girlfriend was a model, Annelie Alpert. A few months after, however, they broke up and Loris started dating fitness model Pamela Rafe. Karius also had relationships with Jan Terose and Sofia Tamala. Both, of course, are also models. Against their background, of all Loris's girlfriends, Janine Wigert stands out for not being a model. She is an influencer and besides work, she is a mother of two children. But let's put them all behind as now the guy seems to have fully dived into a new love adventure. And what a love adventure it is! Of course, this couple would not be that interesting to anyone if Karius's new passion was not already famous in the football world. Diletta is an Italian born in Sicily. She is 31 years old and works as a television presenter on the Dozen platform for Syria R fixtures. In fact, she has been doing her job for the fifth season, being very popular among football fans, gaining 8.6 million followers on Instagram. 
By the way, this is almost five times more than her new chosen one, Loris Karius has. Liata's figure is iconic for football. She became one of those female journalists who opened the door for other women in the industry. In 2018, I remember that I was completely alone on the field. But now there are so many women doing this job, so I'm really happy to be part of this team. Now I think that we are ready to experience an inclusive show with football and women in football. Liata recalled. Naturally, before landing on Dozen and covering Syria A games, she went through the school of Syria B as well as the Women's Champions League. Thereby, her success did not just fall on her head from nowhere. I've loved football since I was a little girl. It never stopped surprising me, and it never stops being exciting. I have to say that I'm lucky because I do what I love to do. Diletta excitedly shares. No doubt, her approach to work is impressive. But it cannot be otherwise. In Italy, football is treated almost like a religion, so there is not much room for mistakes. Still, Diletta advises anyone who wants to go into such a field of interest to stay authentic. You have to be perfect when you talk about football. I was completely obsessed with being perfect and sometimes I lost my authenticity. But now I think that I'm ready to be myself every time and show my personality. Maybe this is one of the most important things that I can do. The journalist urges not to repeat her faults. Before making her way in the number one game, Deletta tried herself at modeling and acting. Luckily, she very quickly understood where her heart truly belonged, choosing the path of football. As for her personal life, Liotta recently broke up with Italian model Giacomo Cavalli. Perhaps it was Carius and Liotta's great attraction to models that eventually brought them together. Although maybe Deletta recognized in Loris another of her ex-boyfriends, the Turkish actor Jan Yaman? Indeed, a certain similarity can be seen between these guys. The relationship between Liotta and Karius is reported by the famous celebrity magazine Gente. Since no joint photos of the couple can be found, the magazine cites other arguments for the existence of this affair. Firstly, a few weeks ago, these two started following each other on Instagram. Secondly, Deletta has recently begun to improve her English. Maybe for professional needs, or maybe for a better understanding with a new man? Believe us, this is enough for lovers of intrigue and celebrity couples to match Liotta and Karius. Folks, write in the comments below whether you are interested in the stories about the lives of footballers who were once at the top but later disappeared from the camera lenses. If so, share in the comments who we should dedicate the next episode to. And that's all for today. Don't forget to support us by hitting the like and subscription buttons. Have a nice one and see you in a bit.